Hey, welcome to the channel, or welcome back. I'll be showing the first two hours of gameplay to help you decide if this game is worth your time and money. In so many times when I've looked forward to a game to discover it's not what I imagined, this disappointment is even worse when I think about the time and money I've wasted, especially when I don't have a lot of either. The games will be a mix of old and new, and maybe even some new releases. The two hours is also in line with most digital refund policies, so hopefully it would give you an idea if you'd enjoy it within that time. I'm not someone that thinks developers owe me a flawless masterpiece of 100 plus hours for every game, and mainly because it's not their responsibility to see how I spend my time and money. So hopefully you'll be able to use this to make your own informed decision. I'll post 30 minute chunks on Monday to Thursday, and then the full two hours on Friday. Hopefully that'll cater to most people's schedules, it also means if you like the look of the game, you might be able to pick it up on a Friday and enjoy it over the weekend when you have more free time. So, before we get into it, if you wish to show support, then like, comment, subscribe. Right, let's go then.
You're coming with us. Nice and easy. Don't think so. <laughs> Not bad. Not bad. the weapon you got this yeah what he said you're coming with us can't get surrounded nope mm. try harder
So what's Soldier Boy's deal? Is he one of us now? He's got balls, this, uh, uh, what was his name again? Cloud. Cloud Strife. Right. And he isn't a soldier anymore. Still, he's a professional, unlike the rest of us. I'm glad to have him. <laughs> this is a one-time gig. When it's done, we're done. Uh, uh, uh. Real joy to work with, though. Real joy to look at, too. Here we go. Looks are what people You'll notice first. You'll keep us safe, right? Guess I'm not on the same page as people. Or even the same. Give it a rest. <laughs> Come on, nobody do something this crazy just for money. They may not think you're a true believer, but you know what I think? Not interested. What? <laughs> Which? Uh... You better be worth the money, Merc. Every last gill. Like you're next. Here we go. <laughs> that it? I found one. Let's do this. Enough. <laughs> So fast, we've got company. This will be quick. Let's go. 
Let's go. Secure our escape route, okay? You go on and catch up with the others. Soldiers may attack on command, but I hear they make good guard dogs too. Bet you've seen a few reactors. So how do we get to the bridge above Mako's storage? <clears throat> Ain't holding out on me, are you? Stamp scared to bite the hand that fed him? Or is he a loyal little doggy? <clears throat> Have it your way, Mutt. We can do this with you, or we can do this without you. Different reactor, different layout. Depends when it was built. Never seen one like this, but I'll manage. Don't you worry. Biggs will have the door open soon. In three, two... Damn, I'm good. Who's there? Door! Whoa, wait! It's over! That's my line. He's alone! We can take him! I got this place covered. Simmer down, hotshot. It's a good thing I know someone who can get us the passcodes. <sighs> Pity no one else at command will talk to us, but what can you do? <sighs> then we're good. Careful in there. is only gonna get tighter, so be ready. We can't afford any more mistakes. <laughs> so, you know Tifa, right? It's not really my business, but are you guys close? Are 
Are you ignoring me? Tifa and I... Sewer rats appear to call themselves Avalanche, sir. We are currently investigating whether they belong to the same group that made the attempt on your life. Rest assured, our inquiries will not take much longer. <laughs> this pump's sole purpose is to drain the planet dry. While you sleep, while you eat, while you shit, it's here sucking up Mako. It doesn't rest, and it doesn't care! You do realize what Mako is, don't you? Mako uh. is the lifeblood of our world. The planet bleeds green like you and me bleed red. The hell you think's gonna happen when it's all gone, huh? Answer me! You gonna stand there and pretend you can't hear the planet crying out in pain? I know you can! You really hear that? Damn straight I do! Get help. <laughs> Say that again! <laughs> I'd worry less about the planet and more about the next five seconds. Save the screaming for later. Our lives are on the line now. You listening, Merc? One false move. And that happens. Well, so much for having Cloud do all the fighting. There are some places a sword just can't reach. <laughs> just bear with him for me, would you? <laughs> yeah. Should have asked for more money. Throw your sword at him? Let the man with the gun go to work. <laughs> These tin cans ain't got nothing on me. <laughs> Suck on this!
Look what we have here. A laser security system. Great. Those things will hurt more than your pride if you're careless. They'll cut you down to size and then some. But I'm guessing you've done this kind of thing before. Yeah. Figure out the timing of the lasers. Then, make a move when they cycle off. Exactly. I'll go first. Nothing like a little danger to get the blood pumping. Hey! Just keep those baby blues of yours on me. over with and we're all look they don't call those things sweepers for nothing they can wipe out a whole squad in seconds not if you wipe the floor with them first ha! we can take this hunk of junk that hunk of junk is a heavy weapons platform if we rush in we die is that right need to hit it with magic that should give us an opening our target, the reactor core. Gotta set the bomb at the bottom. Let's get down there. Oh, it's pounding like a 
attack him. Scared, huh? <laughs> More like excited. I've been dreaming about this for years. Heads up, boys. The end in sight. I leave the rest in your sleepable hands. Good luck. Not that way. Down the ladder, dummy. Let's see if Little Stamp really can bite the hand that feeds. Hmm. Go on. Do the honors. Prove to me you're the man Tifa says you are. That you're one of us. Never said I was. I'm just here for the paycheck. Then do the damn job! Fine. What about the timer? You'll call, Merc. Pretty cocky, ain't you? The internals can be overloaded. Lightning magic. Huh. No other option, huh? Deal with that. Oh, ah. Shit! Uh, should I be worried? Time to fry. Hell yeah! You see the damage that did? Keep it up. Still, suck on this. Better 
win this one for the play. Brilliant plan, genius. <laughs> it's my time to shine. <laughs> or go down in flames. <laughs> if we don't change it up soon, this thing's gonna kill us both. Less talking, more shooting. How about less lift from you? That thunder I hear? Huh? It didn't work? Give them hell. My Bounced right off. Nice try, dumbass. Frontal assault's no good. Gun <laughs> attacks won't cut it. Get off! <laughs> Don't just stand there. Help me out, dammit! <laughs> You good? Not as good as I'd be if you'd actually tried to help me out.
just fight. Adapt. Focus! You focus, soldier boy! 
You ain't gotta worry about me missing my shot. <laughs> showed you how it's done. Come on, we've got to move. Where should we cover our way out? So long. 
Here it comes. That's that. Must have missed it. Take that as a yes.
<sighs> Looks like we made it. And with nothing but a few scratches to show. <laughs> Think you might have overdone it? I followed the instructions to the letter. Maybe it triggered a reaction with the Mako? Well, let's hope the city's still in one piece. But the plan is what matters, right? <laughs> I mean, this must have helped some. After all that, it had better have. Anyway, let's get going. We in Sector 8? That'd be just down there. All right, then. Lead the way. You got it. Huh. Watch out for live wires. They're everywhere. Ugh. The air in here reeks. Can't wait to get out in the open. Man, what is that? I've never smelled anything so foul. Oh, it's me. Gotta do something about that. And soon. I felt that one in my guts. They just keep on coming. We need to get out of this place. Was it the Mako density? The primary explosive? The blasting agent? Hey. We can figure that out later. <sighs> I'm running on empty here. You can refuel at the base. Next time I'll have to bring a little pick-me-up. How much farther do we have to go? Not far. That's about as good a place as any. Stand back then. I'll set the bomb. Can't wait to see you, Marlene. Can't wait to take a hot shower. She's good to go. Fire in the hole! <laughs> you sure told those doors. Let that be a Let's lesson to anything that gets in my way. right it ain't pretty but we can't stop now this was just the first reactor and the planet won't be safe till we get the rest yeah we always knew this was gonna get messy and this is only the beginning y'all gotta look at the bigger picture here nothing worth fighting for was ever won without sacrifice though you may not be crying out I know you're in pain, just like the planet. But it's okay, cause I'm here for you, to help take the load off your shoulders. Your fears, your worries, your concerns, and yes, your feelings. Whatever your problem, I got you. Huh. Hmm. So, What's our next move, boss? That's easy enough. We get our asses home! Hmm. 
We'll split up and shoot for the last train home. Regroup in the freight car. Got it? Later then. Hey. I'd like my money now. You can have it. Once we're back at base. you what this is, right? Of course not. It's healing materia. You can have it for saving my life. Just doing my job, nothing more. Yeah, yeah. Fact is, I'm lucky you were there. <clears throat> Survival can be a matter of luck or skill. And you can't rely on luck. Words to live by. Uh, yeah, well, thanks. You do know how to use it, right? You do know what I was, right? Couldn't be. But then... Do 
You're not real. You're dead. I am. I killed you with my own... <gasps> oh, you need not remind me. It was the crowning moment of our time together. But that was then, and this is now. I have a favor to ask. Our beloved planet is dying. Slowly. Silently. Painfully. Can you bear to see the planet suffer? Cloud. Were the planet to die, so many things would be lost. Your hometown burns so bright. The sound of her voice, pleading for me to spare you. The shiver of her flesh, yielding to cold steel. That which binds us together would be no more, and I would be loath to live in such a world, which is why I must ask you this one favor. Don't worry, it's a simple thing. Run, Cloud. Run away. You have to leave. You have to live. You bastard! Good, Cloud. Very good. Hold on to that hatred. I'm seeing things. Fumes from all the Mako, maybe. All right. You got this. the intruder escape.
Are you okay? I'm fine. Here, this is for you. Huh? A flower? That's right. It's a gift. You know, for scaring those things away. What things? Never mind. Think of it as a memento. Just my luck. I heard that, you know. How much? Well, that depends on the customer. In your case... <laughs> it's on the house. Huh? Lovers used to give these when they were reunited. Look, I'm involved in things. Dangerous things. Oh, I'm sure you are. So? So keep your distance. Wait, you think someone's out to get you? Is that what you're all worked up about? Relax. No one's going to attack you. I promise. Hey, a Mako reactor just blew. You shouldn't be out here trying to self- <laughs>
Underestimate him.
Never in doubt. Confirmed! Target has entered the residential area! All are not in effect! All you have to do is get mine down! Get mine down! Escape! No way! Uh. 
This cloud won't be joining us after all. No need to assume the worst. I'm sure he's fine. You saw him in action, didn't you? Guy's a soldier. Goddamn one-man army. Mm -hmm. Hmm. You think he's a keeper? Public security, the runaround. That's what. Had to draw them away from the station somehow. Nicely done. Well, can't argue with results, huh? <clears throat> what? <sighs> Wait. Got a question for you all. What? Ever been attacked by an invisible enemy? Robes came and went like the wind. <laughs> Thought they were invisible. They were at first. Only saw them after she grabbed me. A new Shinra weapon, maybe? <laughs> More like a panic-induced hallucination. <clears throat> Never mind. Forget I said anything. Suit yourself. Come on, let's move up. And in the freight car, too. Because of the evacuation order, maybe? Lucky this us. We've got a crowd to hide here. Head for the front of the train to hold there. Due to an explosion at Mako Reactor 1.
An emergency schedule is now in effect. Your understanding and cooperation is appreciated. Get the Just called in sick. <sighs> Just leave You're, me alone, uh, all right? Holding up pretty well, huh? I'm Even thankful. after what we saw at the station and all over Sector 8? I'm a soldier. Wow. My hands are still shaking. You get used to it. Something to look you forward see, to. My daughter now or lives in Sector maybe 8, not. so. Do you think Wu ties to blame? Little help, Cloud? Please? I can't stop thinking about it. The bomb yeah, I made shouldn't have produced an explosion that big. It doesn't make any sense. The explosion triggered a reaction with the Mako. You said so yourself. That was my first guess, but shouldn't the reactor have fail-safes to prevent that kind of thing? Hmm. You mentioned invisible enemies back there, right? Right. Oh, no. I'm just looking for excuses for something that was clearly my own fault. Gotta own up to it if I'm gonna learn from this and move on. Thanks, Cloud. You're a good listener. What kind of maniacs would go so far as to bomb a reactor? <sighs> They've yet to announce it publicly, but I heard it was Avalanche's doing. Really? Aren't they the terrorists who tried to kill the president? Is there nothing they won't do? Hey, quit talking out your ass. Everyone knows Avalanche only cares about saving the planet. Hmm? Just, just who do you think you are? A law-abiding concerned citizen. Law-abiding? Really? Hmm. <laughs> uh, uh, shh. In my humble opinion, that explosion was a message. A message to the bastards bleeding our planet dry. Think they got it? Heard it loud and clear? Y'all's masters? We will not submit to intimidation or violence, but work together for peace and prosperity. That is how civilized people change the world! That's right! That is the Shinra Creed! Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Them spiting words. It's what we believe. We all have to follow our conscience, don't we? We should go. Right. <laughs> this out of the way. Personally, I find visual aids make the dull stuff a lot more bearable. If it helps, think of it as an initiation rite. How many times do I have to tell you people? I'm not... <clears throat> There's such a thing as playing too hard to get. So, here we've got a wireframe model of the great city of Midgar, complete with massive steel plates suspended 300 meters above ground level, atop which stands a shining beacon of civilization. The whole system is sustained by the Mako reactors, which feed the insatiable appetites of the public. The train will be passing through an ID checkpoint shortly. This here is the train's route. As you can see, it'll take us around this main pillar. Look, we're about halfway through it now. They've set up a checkpoint here to scan the IDs of all passengers heading in and out. 
date of birth, residential status, criminal history, all that and more is automatically cross-referenced in their databases. Public security wouldn't have it any other way. Heads up. <coughs> Don't worry, our IDs are impeccable. What'd I tell you? Have a little faith. Won't be long till we reach the bottom. Relax. Take a good look. It's because of that great big pizza in the sky that people down there gotta struggle to survive. Shinra sucks up Mako while the soil turns to dust, the air fills with smog, and the flowers die. Then leave and don't look back. <sighs> that's what's always worked for me. <sighs> well, that's all well and good. If you're only out for yourself. But the folks down there don't have the luxury of choice, you know. Like this train, I suppose. There's only one way it can go. One, members lost zero. And one step closer to a brighter future. Hell yeah! Guys! Lower your voices, huh? People are listening. Oh, darn. Right. Ah. Hmm. Now get some r, &R. You've earned it. Just be ready for the next mission, all right? Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> See you soon. Uh, at Seventh Heaven. You know, where Tifa works. Don't keep her waiting. She'll worry. Don't you worry. We're going to smoke tea when it happens. We'll up and running. Uh, I've never felt the ground what shake kind of like that. <clears throat> Dumb Pleiades only had it so good because of the reactors. And this bombing's changed. Mm -hmm. I've never seen anything like it before. Mm -hmm. It was like a giant mm -hmm. handle. Oh, the piled like up like stomach. mountains. You couldn't go nowhere. Huh. Mako is the lifeblood of the planet? Hell it is. Goddamn eco warriors with their dumbass posters. I tear them down and they're back up inside of an hour. Like I've got nothing better to do. I mean, look at all that steelwork. You trying to tell me that's not progress? <laughs> <laughs> Mako junkie, huh? Figures. You again. That hot shower can't come soon enough. I can barely tell my skin from all the ash and sweat. 
When I get back, it's refueling time. You, Jesse? I don't know. Get out how I feel. Warning. Gate broken. Fiends in area. Exercise caution. No reason to check it out. Not my problem. Remember the last time I saw a real one? <laughs> huh? <sighs> How sweet. When did you get so thoughtful? A guy can change. It has been five years. Huh? I need to talk to Barrett. Right. Come on in. Daddy, the Mako place blew up. Everyone on TV is talking about it. Don't you worry about all that silliness. Daddy's here and he's not going anywhere tonight. Now turn that thing off and let's get you to bed, huh? Uh. <laughs> hey! What uh, the hell do you think you're doing scaring my daughter like that? Daddy says never talk to strangers. <laughs> That's right, honey, I do say that. What a good girl you are remembering daddy's lessons. <laughs> you know what else good girls do? They go to bed on time. Come on. But I'm not tired. I want to talk some more, daddy. Mm, all right, but just this once. <sighs> uh, so then, what can I get you? My money. I'm still waiting on it. Uh, right. About that, we should talk outside. <sighs> um, Daddy, did the people who died all return to the planet? Of course. Let that be a lesson to you. When you want to talk to a little kid, don't go give another professional killer eyes. Before we get on to money, there's an empty apartment in a place just down the road. It's nothing fancy, but I was thinking you could stay there for now. The landlady's a big friend of the cause, so you wouldn't even have to pay rent. Sound good? Sure does. Thanks. <laughs> Follow me then. How was it up on the plate? It was when the Mako chaotic. Exploded, Sorry wow, for dragging you into shape. all this. It was it was wrong of me to put you in danger news. like that. I promise I won't do it again. Dangerous part of the job. Don't worry about me. Mm. I'll try not to. Always happy to help stick it to Shimmer. Not good at 
I don't know what it is, but my life feels so empty. you make nice with everyone? As much as I could, all things considered. Maybe not enough for them. Good. You had me worried. You're not exactly a people person. I'll give you that. I saw Sector 8 on the news. It was like a war zone. The news is just another Shinra mouthpiece. They'll spread whatever lies Shinra tells them to. Attack Sector so, 7? The top it wasn't that bad? On it was. Oh, right. And here we are. Good old Stargazer Heights. You're on the second floor. Room 201 here is where I sleep. Don't have time for much else, what with 7th Heaven and all. <laughs> Not even time to decorate. Here's your room, 202. Don't worry, I already told the landlady about you. You did? Yes? Oh, I mean I told her I had a friend looking for a place to stay. Was that too much? No. It's fine. And this? That one's, uh... Know what? It's getting late. I'll introduce you tomorrow. It's a little bare, but should be enough to get you through the night. If you want anything else, we can always there get it. There is one thing. My money. You guys owe me 2,000, remember? I do. And we'd love to settle up, especially since this was your first job for us, but... That's it? Sorry. We spent the rest preparing for the mission. That really is it. But not for long. I'm collecting money for filters tomorrow, so I can pay you after. <sighs> And you're sure about that? Of course, as long as you help, that is. Wait, then I'd have to pay you for that, too. Never mind. No, two thousand's enough. That's what we agreed on, so that'll be the price. With what you gave me, that leaves fifteen hundred. You're the best! I'll see you bright and early at the bar, then. Thanks again for everything. Sleep tight. <sighs> It's time for introductions. What are you 
you doing to Marco? This is his apartment. He's got a few problems, but he's not a bad guy. The landlady asked me to check on him now and then to make sure he's okay. Can I ask you to do the same? Sure. Well now, you must be Cloud. I'm Marl, your landlady. So how'd you like the place? You from up on high? I've been around. I'll bet. No matter. All kinds come through with all kinds of reasons. If you ever need an ear to bend, I'll lend you mine. It can be about anything, even Tifa. What's she to you? The granddaughter I never had. And if you hurt her, I'll take it out of your hide. You hear me? Loud and clear. Good. Now you'd best get a move on to Seventh Heaven. She's got a head start on you and then some. Nothing to report. Maintaining survival. The Watch is saying they're gonna step up their game. Searching for candidates. That who Wedge mentioned? That sword's massive. Does he sell again? That sword's massive. Does he Searching sell again? for candidates. The trains don't start moving again. Don't try anything funny or you'll get it. The kids seem to think you're pretty cool. Morning. Hey. Just so you know, Marlene's still asleep. <sighs> Let's get down to business, shall we? Huh? These water filters won't replace themselves. <laughs> Although the next batch probably could, if Jessie put her mind to it. Most every home in the area has one. Folks love them because they practically eliminate the rotten egg smell. Honestly, they make us more money than this place. And it's easy money, too. We bring new filters, collect the old ones, and get paid. What? <sighs> Give me a break. I'm not a salesman. 
I'm a soldier. Which is why no one will refuse to pay. What do you say? Uh, Please? <sighs> Let's get this over with. Great. And while we're at it, I'll give you the grand tour. and keep whatever we collect. Seeing as you didn't bring any luggage, I'm guessing there's stuff you need to buy. Thanks. And don't worry. We'll pay you the difference Everyone's after. Barrett's out making his rounds, too. Some creepy dude hit on All the items you could want straight from the plate. No matter your need. Hey there. Here to change out your water filter. Tifa, baby, how you doing? Been waiting for you to... Wait, let me see. Cloud's in charge of collections. He'll take your money. Sounds like a pretty sweet gig. If you ever need someone to fill in, I'm your man. In your dreams, maybe. Huh? Cloud! Uh, since we're here, maybe we should do a little shopping. Suppose I could take a look? Thanks. If you're ever in the market for anything else, drop on by. Especially if Teeth is with you. We'll see you around, okay? And let us know when your filter next needs changing. All the items you can want. Straight from the He's a regular. Stock up here, and he might throw in a freebie or two. For you, maybe. Well. You could try being a little nicer. To get free shit? Not my style. <laughs> Our next stop is Stargazer Heights. Landlady's a client. Just met her. Then you know what to expect. Remember, she's a good friend of Avalanche, so be nice. Please? Mm -hmm. Just imagine if rich people start thinking it's safer down here than on the plane. My husband decided to go to the station and see if they could get Nothing to report. Maintaining surveillance. Hey, Marl. Got some filters for ya. Tifa, my dear, dear girl. Oh, what's he doing here? Working? Be nice. <laughs> Cloud's helping me with collections. You better take care of her. I'm pretty good at taking care of myself, you know. That I do. Still, better him than you. No charm, no wit, big sword, but no skills. I've got skills. Be nice. I'm doing my best. You're looking awfully glum. Are you getting enough sleep? A good long rest will cure anything, I tell you. A tried and true lesson for life on the ground floor, am I right? That you are. Now, your money. Thanks, Marl. You take care of yourself. Don't do anything I wouldn't do. Marl's great. She helped get me set up back in the day. You been here a while now? Five years, give years or take. Probably because of those vets but who never up mind that. We've got to get you your money. Maybe, Last stop is the weapon store. Hey, 
Hey, if it isn't Tifa. You here for the filter? Uh... Hey! That last filter didn't do shit! We're so sorry about that. Hopefully this one will work better. Save your excuses and get out! Alright. If you could just settle your bill, we'll be on our way. The hell? You charging me for your busted ass goods? My associate handles payment disputes. Think you can mosey up in here and have it your way? Pretty please. <sighs> Thank you very much. Seeing as we're done with our rounds and you've got a small fortune now, why not take a gander at the weapons? Well, when will Barrett be back with the rest? <sighs> Before we open up tonight. It'll be a while yet, so... What do you want to do? Don't really know. In that case, I've got a suggestion. Want to hear it? If you're serious about becoming a merc, then you're going to need to start making connections. It's not what you know, but who you know, you know? Hmm. Another lesson for life on the ground floor. Yep. Connections get you jobs. Jobs build your rep. And more rep gets you better connections. How do I start? Hmm. Why not help out the Neighborhood Watch? They're mostly volunteers, but you'll get to know people. Yeah, okay. Didn't see anybody at the office, so let's head up top. No better way to keep you and your family safe than with a weapon of your own. Come and check out our selection. Huh? Speak with our friendly I ain't got nothing for a punk-ass bitch like you. Needs. Get on out of here! No better way to keep you and your family safe than with a weapon of your own. Come and check out our selection. Gotta do something about the monsters on Scrap Boulevard. I'll head on down there first thing tomorrow. Not alone, you won't. Huh. Didn't know you were holding down the fort. Huh? Oh, uh, hey, Cloud. Um, Looking to join the neighborhood watch? That depends. What does this neighborhood watch do? Uh... Lots of stuff, really. But our top priority is taking care of any beasts that wander into town. That, and teaching the locals how to defend themselves. Like they say, the only one who will look out for you is you. Cloud's a great fighter, but only we know that. If no one knows him, no one will hire him. Thought if he joined the Watch, he could get his name out there. That would work for everybody. Truth be told, we could really use your help. We can't pay you in Gil, but we'll work something out. For example, aha, what about your sword? I could mod it for you. No thanks, it's fine just the way it is. What, you some kind of purist? I know I'd never pass up a chance to improve my gear. Come on, at least let me show you how it's done.
All set? Needless to say, you'll have to try it out to appreciate the difference. Thanks. <laughs> we'll do you one better. Spread the word to everyone who'll listen about the new Mercantown. Between him and Wedge, there isn't anyone they don't know. I'll march through the streets singing your praises, even on an empty stomach. So, where are these monsters? Scrap Boulevard. Good hunting. Hey, Cloud, I'll come with. No, I've got this. But you don't know the way, do you? We don't. <laughs> sure thing. I know these streets better than anyone. If you made it this far, then thank you. Also, leave a comment of how you think the game looks so far. If you like the video, press like, subscribe, turn on notifications, stay informed when the next video is live. New videos are released Monday to Friday.